Another year winding down for the studio to stage Dance Academy, and it's no surprise to see a well-donned performance hit the stage of the North Peace Cultural Center. We have anything and everything in it, pretty much. Tap, jazz, ballet, acrobatics, musical theater. Um, so the kids have been working hard all year, and this is our final show to show off what they've been doing. Through the night, more than 20 special performances roared the Cultural Center to life. Milne works with each and every one of them, from as young as four years old up to those graduating this year. A lot of times you're learning how to work the class with those beginners, and the kids that know the class, you're can be a little bit harder on them trying to get, you know, really what they can do with their bodies and how they can actually, you know, achieve that. For many, achievement is the main reason they enroll in the club in the first place. Whether it's tap, jazz or ballet, each student will set goals to reach by the end of the year. And that's exactly what the spring recital is meant to showcase. I feel like I've improved a lot this year. I mean, I did take a break a while, a little bit ago. So I came back, I feel like I've done really well. Some of the dances are our competition numbers and some of them we've just been working on for the recital. A lot of the kids have accomplished goals. A lot of them set, like, I really want to get my splits this year. I want to get that triple pirouette. And, you know, for most of the part, most of the part they get it. And it's been really nice to see those kids flourish that way. For the older students, dancing is very important to them. In fact, many have been part of Milne's class for more than a decade, with more serious long-term goals including competitive dancing. My older sister has been competitive, so I started when I was really young with Shauna, and I've been here ever since. I've never gone to provincials, and that was one of my goals to get to go to provincials, and I, I was chosen in Quinell to go to provincials. But if you think these dances were impressive, wait till next Thursday night when the competitive dancers highlight their solo performances in the Academy's Dance Gala. Mitch Bach, CJDC-TV News, Fort St. John.